This is a video that I'm working on that I want to be able to add text, um, not text, voiceover to. So you're actually going to be um, viewing me doing an actual video that I'm working on for a course that we're in. So that's kind of exciting because you're kind of getting a preview of a video um, in a paid course that we're making um, as well as you get to learn how to do a voiceover in your own video. So in this video right here, what I have is um, uh, images and video that I've edited. Okay, so it starts off with um, a bunch of images and there's some transitions in between and then I kind of cut into a video, then I cut into an image and then I cut into some more video. So it's a really complex um, video that I've put together. Now right here what you're going to see is text. This is just different text that's been added. So there's a, what I want you to see is that it's multi-layered, okay? And I'm going to add voiceover to this multi-layered video. Um, there's also music. That's what this is here um, in the video. So just lots of things going on. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add voiceover to this. And I might make some mistakes. And sometimes it takes me a few tries. Sometimes my baby starts screaming. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and try to record a voiceover for this right now. And you can kind of see my process and how I do that. So I would just go to record and record voiceover and it's going to pop this box up. Okay. And what I would do is when I'm ready, I would just hit this button here. And what I'm going to try to do is read with the flow um, of what's going on in the screen. And that's not always easy to do. So you might need to take a few cuts. And um, what I do is I record multiple voiceovers rather than one really long one. So watch what I do. Instead of focusing on getting as much externally as we can, see I messed up, I didn't even read it correctly there. So I would just hit stop if you mess up and, um, and you will, and you will mess up. And then see right here, this is where I was talking. I'm going to go ahead and just delete that. Okay. And then I'm going to just start over. Instead of focusing on getting as much as we can externally, such as followers, traffic, page views, what if we focused on growing internally? What if we let go of our attachment to results and allow our inner guidance to create something amazing and fulfilling more than you could have ever planned. So right there is where my voiceover will stop. And there it is, it's recorded. Um, and another way that you can record a voiceover, say you want to do it in pieces, and this was what I was originally gonna show you, but I kinda just go with the flow. So there's two ways you can do this. I'm gonna take this out right now, and I wanna show you the second way you can because um, you can record frame by frame if you want to do that. So I just took that out for right now, but I am going to put it back. Okay, I just cut it out for the, mo for the moment. Um, but this is what I'm going to do. Watch. You can do it frame by frame. Instead of focusing, and then what you can do is you can move it over here, okay, to where you want it on the timeline. On getting as much as we can externally, stop. See how I stopped there? Then I can just bring it to the next one. And you can have multiple voiceovers. So let me show you how that worked. Um, instead of one long voiceover, you can have just multiple short ones. Um, so you, in case you know, there's. I, sometimes I do that if I have a super long video. This was a really short voiceover. But if I have a really long one, I will break up the voiceovers like this. 
Oh, that didn't come out good. Okay, so, um, and what I can do is I can actually turn that up. Well, here, let me control Z. I can turn up my voice um, just by clicking on it and going to, let me move that over, the volume, and then hitting OK. And that's, um, and I'll just turn the volume up. Okay, so if we can't hear me, that's an, um, something you can do. And again, yours is going to be better than this. I have lots of background noises going on. Um, you're going to want to be in a quiet place, but watch. See how it just broke it up into pieces? So you can do that. Um, you can do that too. I'm going to paste my old one back in there and delete this one. I'm uh, just going to drag in my old one back in there. And so let me see how my old one sounds. Now, this is the really, really long one. It does save your voiceovers up here. It adds it to your media. So if you delete it or whatever, it's still going to be up here. Um, so don't freak out. It's like, oh, my gosh, I deleted it. Um, it's going to be up here. If you recorded a voiceover, it's going to be up here. Now, figuring out which one is which. Um, but it is there. Um, so here we go. You can hear that my music is way too loud. So what I need to do is I need to turn down, I need to turn up my voice by clicking on it and pushing up my volume and removing the background noise. Okay. Um, and I'm going to hit OK. Um, and then I'm going to click on my music, which is here, and I'm going to turn that down. Okay. I'm going to turn it down to maybe... I don't know. You're going to have to play with it, but I'm going to put it at a 15 and see what happens. Okay, so let's move this timeline bar and press play. See, and mine, um, you can hear the voiceover. Mine could be because I'm also using screencast and I'm using this recorder. So it could just be, the reason. it doesn't usually sound that bad. Um, I think the reason mine is sounding that bad is because I have two recorders going at the same time. Yours will sound a lot better than that. But I just kind of want to show you, I can turn up the volume on your voice. You can turn down the music and you can add voiceover and you can do, um, you can do those kinds of things with it. Okay, so adding a voiceover, real simple. You're just going to go to record, voiceover, and that box is going to pop up, and you're going to do your thing. Just remember that this black bar tells you where you're at on the timeline. So if you want to start recording voiceover, say, here, you need to make sure that that is where um, it needs to be. Okay, and I hope this was helpful to you, and I will talk to you in the next video.